Hi, today I'm going to show you how to take a video that you've created on iMovie, saved it onto your desktop, and now you're ready to display it. You're going to be able to loop it. That's what we're doing today. We're going to loop a video. So why would you want to use looping? Well, looping is great if you're going to be showing a video that maybe is going to be playing in the background. Um, Often in my classroom, I use this on the Promethean board so that parents, when they come in, they can have an idea of what we've been doing all year, or maybe I filmed a project that we've been working on and parents can see the process of it. It's just a way to have something continually going so you're not monitoring it when it ends that you have to, you know, turn it back on. So looping is great for those kinds of situations. Okay, so let's actually get to how to loop. You click on the video that you want looped, and then you click on view, click loop here at the bottom, and this is a video that I created on Chatterpix. Chatterpix is great because you can take an inanimate object or even a picture of yourself, and you draw a line across where the mouth would be, and then you can animate that picture. So you're going to see uh, the quick animation that I created, but now you're going to see it looped. Let's say we wanted to loop this video several times. Well, this is the video that we're going to loop, so you're going to see it several times. Let's say we wanted to loop this video several times. Well, this is the video that we're going to loop, so you're going to see it several times. Let's say we wanted okay, to loop Okay, I think that's enough of that. I think you get the gist. And I just wanted to say thank you for watching the video, and I hope it's beneficial for you and however it is that you're going to be using it. Have a great day.